My lord, they took my food. <gasps> Every last scrap. Do you see where they went? Northeast, into the woods. If I find them, they'll regret stealing from you. Please don't harm them. They're just as desperate as I am. No promises. Something's over. Looking for me? Can't wait to see him bleed. Rice. Must be the food they stole. You're back. I have your food. Rice. I don't remember the last time I had rice. You said they stole it from you. Please, for forgive me. You lied to me. Bandits don't deserve food at a time like this, my lord. Besides, I ask you not to hurt them. They gave me no choice. Oh, I'm sorry. You shouldn't have lied. I still would have helped you. I won't do it again. I promise.
samurai will never defeat the Mongols in the armor I saw him wearing. Well, what do you expect him to do? You've heard Yamato's story of the legendary armor, right? The one with the farmers? Ah, that's the one. Of course, but they're just legends. <laughs> I tried to save her. She clutched my hand. Still can't believe how fast the Mongols took over everything. I was in Azam the Bay when they arrived. <laughs> My lord, will you please help me? Traders and pirates. What traders or pirates could wipe out the samurai with strange fire weapons? Huh? There, me. Miss my home. My friend. I miss her. What is it? I have to get to a camp in the woods, occupied by people who are seriously ill. They need a healer. The area is overrun with bandits and Mongols. Yes. I'll need protection. I can get you there. But the sickness concerns me. You're sure you can fight it? Sickness isn't something you fight. It's something you have to care for. If the people are as ill as you say, we should leave now. Stop the sickness before it spreads. Thank you, my lord. survived the battle at Komoda. It was thanks to a woman, Yuna. She rescued me from the beach, nursed me back to health. She sounds like a gifted healer. She's one of the bravest people I know. I wouldn't be here without her. My mother did the same for me. As a boy, I was always sick, but through her knowledge of herbs, she made me strong. She's the reason I'm a healer. Wait, I think I see something up ahead. Good eye. Stay back. Let me handle it. Where are you hiding, you fool? We don't have any! Face me! Stay alive! I thought they were going to kill us. You shouldn't be traveling here alone. We had to leave our farmstead, my lord. Everyone there is sick. What brought it on? Spirits. Our ancestors are punishing us. We gave the Mongols our food instead of fighting back. When they left, everyone grew ill. Now our home is cursed. There's an inn just down the road. You should be safe there. It's much too dangerous outside. Get indoors and stay there. Thank you. I only hope the spirits don't follow us. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm 
do for anything. You're quite the butcher with that sword. What would you have done with the bandits? In my experience, firm but polite words go a long way. You have experience with bandits then? I just think one should try to resolve a problem peacefully before resorting to violence. Spoken like a healer. You chose the right occupation. What is it? What's wrong? It's my son. I think he ate something poisonous. Take me to him. What about those suffering at the camp? We've already delayed. It will only take a moment. I'll help. Perhaps we can make this quick. Thank you, my lord. I knew. We have no food. I'll see if I can find what it was. Thank you, my lord. Rice baskets empty. Nothing but boiled water. Just straw. Wild mushrooms, half eaten. This must be it. I should tell Hanaoka. Did you find anything? Half eaten mushrooms. You fool! You know better! He must have eaten them out of desperation. I can make an antidote, but I need river moss. Stay with him. I'll find the moss. My lord, did you find the moss? Here it is. Homeo, listen carefully. Crush this moss, add it to a cup of water and bring to a boil. Have him drink the mixture and he should be fine by tomorrow morning. Those at the camp need us now. Yes, let's go. Thank you for saving my son. You know, that man's symptoms were the same as the couple from the farmstead. Aching, vomiting, labored breathing. Symptoms of poisoning? You think the farmstead was poisoned? I'm almost sure of it. In which case, I'll need tubers to treat them. The moss was fine for that man, but tubers are stronger. They grow at a nearby pond. Let's be quick.
mongols. And right by the pond. Would you like to talk to them? Ask them politely to move? I'll leave this to your discretion, my lord. Negium Harsinta, to you also. Over here, my lord. You found the tubers? Yes. Thanks to you, I'm able to harvest them. It's just... watching you, I can't help but wonder if you enjoy the violence. I kill only to protect our people. I think about that every time I reach for my soul. Of course. I'm sorry, my lord. Let's go heal those who need it. The camp should be just ahead. Healer, my wife, she stopped breathing. How long has she been sick? Ever since the Mongols came by our farmstead. What did she eat? We had no food. Just water from the well. I'm sorry. She's gone. <laughs> if only I'd gotten here sooner. You did your best. But maybe if I hadn't delayed, with that couple and that man. If we hadn't stopped, those people would be dead. You also wouldn't have figured out these people were poisoned. Perhaps. But I still don't know how. That man said his wife had nothing but water from the well. And we know people started getting sick after the Mongols left. They must have polluted the well. A contaminated water source would spread sickness like wildfire. But it's treatable? Yes, the tubers will see to it. Then help those you can. Thank you, my lord. You have saved many lives.
Stand and fight! Харву! А тут бери! А тут бери!
Ci harwo. Ojciec Ben. Thank you. 